It is a weekend, and the sun is shining brightly outside Kate and Lynn's home. The two girls are busy helping their mom do the household chores. It is very hot outside the house. While cleaning the front lawn, they can feel beads of sweat forming on their faces. The heat from the sun is transferred to Earth by radiation. This is one type of heat flow. Radiation allows heat to flow in a vacuum. Kate's bike is on the front lawn. She approaches the bike and holds the metal handlebars. Immediately, she lets go and exclaims, Ouch! It's so hot! This is another type of heat flow called conduction. The heat of the hot metal handlebars is transferred to Kate's hands, which are cooler. Conduction happens in solids. Next, Kate and Lynn rush to the kitchen to help their mom cook spaghetti, and the water is bubbling in the pot. They can see steam rising from the boiling water. Another type of heat flow is called convection. The hot water at the bottom of the pot rises, and the cold water at the top of the pot sinks. This forms convection currents, a circulating stream that rises and falls continuously. Radiation, conduction, and convection are different ways of heat flow. In all the three ways of heat flow, heat flows from a hotter area to a colder area. Once the objects reach the point where they have the same temperature, the objects are said to be in thermal equilibrium.